Well, hey guys, it's Jeff again. Just wanted to let you see this amazing house that just hit the market. And I'm gonna give you a personal walkthrough. So when you first come in, you've got a big, 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 huge open air. A lot of people like those glass doors when they first walk in, how cool is that? And then lay of the land, you've got big, huge open family area. The master's on one side. So if you want a master on the main and an office on the main and your guest bedroom is to be downstairs, this is the house. Let's start in with the office. So the first thing you'll see as you come down this hallway is a full bath. So if you have a mom or a pops or somebody that's got to take care of upstairs, they've got a walk-in shower, which is awesome. This one has every single bell and whistle. Upgraded faucets, the fun floor tile, they set this one up as a guest room, but you could have this as an office. Nice high ceilings, beautiful finishes again, look at that fan. Another big window. Of course, lots of construction going on. Look at the staircase. So, nice railing there instead of the spindles. Beautiful hardwood floors. Massive mirror, look at that. As you go into coming off the garage, you got your three car garage there, but then you have your mud room, which is a little sitting area. Can you see that? Very cool. You got a coat closet area there. You got a huge pantry with a pocket door or a uh, laundry room, folding table, uh, ceramic tile. Look at the hooks. Those are gorgeous and all pl plenty, plenty of cabinet space. Neat little nook there. I won't show you three car garage, but now it's back up. Look at this, this fireplace, the beams, surround sound here, go like that so you can see the, yeah, look at that. There's the water. The view of the water is all the way across this whole entire side right there, all the way across. But big family room space, open to your dining space, open to your kitchen, expansive ceiling. Look at that fireplace. Oh, and one of the fireplaces, like look at this, this is one of those 60 inchers and it doesn't have any heat that comes off of this. So you can have the TV completely flush with that. So when you touch this, as far as kids go, there's no, no heat there. It, ex it exhausts out there. We'll just take a walk over here. So you can see the view. The backyard is gorgeous. We'll show you that part last, but okay. So going back into the kitchen area. There's a nice little sitting area right there if you just want to view the lake. On this lake, we've got just about everything. Joe, our bald eagle, sits over in that perch right over there. We've got all kinds of critters. I'll tell you about that. I'll take too long to go over all that, but look at the dining room. The cabinets are gorgeous. White enamel. They've upgraded to the quartz that you see here. The sink is over by the window, which is super cool. Look at these light fixtures. All high-end finishes, look at this one. That's super cool. And then in the kitchen, they've got the light, they've got the, uh, the lights that come through the cabinets there. The cooktop, they wanted it to match. So look at that, it's, an, it's one of the inductions. So when you touch it, it doesn't get hot. It also doesn't require a vent but super high in there. Terry would have to show me how this all works, but you can put the pot, it'll boil immediately, it's slide it off and you can touch this. Super cool. You got the sink, you got the window, you can see out, you can actually see the water from here. That's really cool. And then we go into this monster pantry. Oh, automatic light. Look at this, all the way around. It's got the little glass door so light shines through. And then the other thing, sorry, I don't want to go too fast. Vertigo people there, but look at that. Like a coffee station. So they've got their little wine bar there. Whatever you want, make your toast. That's a good way to wake up in the morning and then you don't have to see it. And again, the window, looking right out on the patio. The winds are like 50 miles an hour right now. So when we go outside, it's gonna be a little intense, but we'll do that last. But there's a covered area, the ceiling fan. Okay, now let's head on downstairs. Turn around so you don't have to look at me. Look at that 
that fine family room. Looks like a resort. Oh, we don't go downstairs yet. We gotta go to the master. So here we are. Hardwood floors coming in here. Look at that. Double box ceiling, beautiful fan. Another great view of the lake right here, all the way around. That's one nice thing about being out here. You can just, wherever you are, you see the lake perfectly. Oops, dropping my phone. Look at the master. So double sinks there, beautiful tile. And check out this shower. It's completely seamless, no door. Of course, you know what you gotta do then. You gotta walk in the shower. <laughs> the stool in the corner inside where you sit. Look how big this thing is. I love that. Check that out. You put your towel right here. Nice lights. And then, okay, I don't wanna to go too fast. So turn around. You get your commode. And then they expanded their closet. So they have the, instead of having the tub and the shower, they've got a larger closet. So all of this space, all of this space, and then they got that extra space back since they didn't need the tub. Most people don't want tubs these days. Some people do, most don't. All right, now we'll go downstairs. Their artwork is gorgeous. Okay, here's a good view. In the foyer, as you come in, beautiful, beautiful. There's your stairs. Oh, I got to point out this too from High V. Look at that. So they got the KNC Royals here, and then check out the back. Mahomes. Mahomes the Royals, part of the Royals. Super cool. All right, coming downstairs. We got 12 foot soaring ceilings. And look how high those things are. Absolutely incredible. The finished beam they did there. He actually left the I beam there and put special paint on it. So that way you can, in case of a fire or whatever, not that you would knock on wood. Not that we ever would, but there you go. Let's come in here and take a look. So there's your patio view again. There we go. See how you can see the lake all the way, no matter where you are downstairs. And then we have the custom bar. They got the granite. They got the granite down here. They've got a little sink, and you got all kinds of cabinet spaces, and you got little cool walt or scotch lights. This is Terry's office, so it's completely open. You can see all the way up, which is gorgeous. And then here's the family room. Really cool lights. Look at those. So it's split. So you've got a bedroom over there with its bathroom, and then you've got a bedroom over here with its bathroom. So that way. You have some privacy. He's got bunk beds for the kiddos when they come to town. And they've got a full bath here. And again, another walk-in shower, which is super cool and easy to clean, beautiful finishes, and a massive closet. Look at that. Big, 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 big. Okay. And again, view of the lake. Gotta have it, right? Okay, we'll come back in here. Look at that. I'll just stand right here for a second so you can see. It's beautiful. He did the polished floors, which are so cool. Very clean feeling. And then the huge sliding glass doors. Like, I can't even touch that. They're huge. But look at that. It looks like a resort. And this is like a 16,000 square foot lot. It's huge. He's got his boat dock out there, or his uh, swim platform out there. And the lot goes all the way from that stake out there all the way over, which we'll go out there if we can see or hear because of the wind. But anyway, go in and look at the other bedroom. So as you come down the hallway, or this little hallway here, it splits. And then you have this another, it's almost like a massive master bedroom downstairs. So if you wanted to master up and a master down, again, 12 foot ceilings, lower level. Totally get a king size bed in here. Massive closet. Oops, going too fast. 
I don't want the video to be too long. And then we have the tub over here. If you can see that. And then the storage. We'll have to do another video for the storage, but this I'll show you just the highlights here. When you come in, it's got all of the stereo equipment, everything wired here, which is awesome. Of course, that's not staying with the house, but at least it's wired. This door goes to your suspended storage space. And look at how big it is all the way over there. He did custom shelving. He's going to do a wood shop there. Check out all the storage there. Look at that. It's just massive. So if you need storage, you need four bedrooms, you want lots of entertaining space, this is the place to be. Okay. Another really cool thing about this is that he built this wall. It's a shadow wall. We'll have to do another video. If you actually do the lights, like on on those uh, game shows and all the stuff, like uh, America's Got Talent, where you have you pose and it leaves an image on there when the lights are out. So that's super cool. It's called a shadow wall. I'll have to tell you more about that later in another video. And then let's go outside. Ooh, here we go. Check that out. There's just so many things to point out in this house because it's just not like a regular house where it's just an inventory home. He's done all of the extra finishes himself. Things that you would not get, things that you would not think about whenever you're building, you're like, oh, I wish I could have done this. I mean, there's really nothing in this house that he's like, I wish we would have done this. I wish we would have done that. We've got it all. Let's go out and see how bad the wind is. Another really cool thing about this is it's west facing. So the sun rises right over those trees right there, goes up over the top and around one o'clock in the afternoon or so, you'll have actually, this is completely shaded and then it drops over the front of the house. So you can always use your patio. But there's the view of the lake. So from here, all the way over that you see that, look at that. There will be houses over there eventually more still expanding but one of the best features in my opinion of this house is that you get to have some neighbors like right over there it's leslie because that's our house <laughs> coffee yeah you got any what else you baking today are you baking anything today whatever you want You've got our number, you'll have to give us a call. If you want more information about this house, my number is 816-730-9755. I live in Creekmore, I love Creekmore. This will be the place that we live forever and you would absolutely love this house. Come out and check it out. Like I said, you've got our number, give us a call. See you later, babe. Thanks guys, see you later.